Welcome to our second episode. First time having my daughter Gianna. Well, together. Uh, she's been on the show before. Um, the main reason why we have this channel is because of you. That's for a period of time you're going to be, you and I are going to be three hours apart or four hours apart. So because of that, I started cooking for her and recording it, hoping that she could watch it in her time. So that was quite some time ago and now we don't have to do that anymore. But we're going to continue on the show. So uh, this episode is going to be about uh, instant noodle um, hacking. And I'm going to explain why we do, we do that. Um, one, this is Gian's favorite. It's uh, the brand is Mama, uh, I believe it's from Southeast Asia. Uh, they make a couple different flavors. Um, I'm sure you guys have seen it. There's hundreds, if not thousands of different flavors. There's another kind. And obviously, uh, not I should say obviously, I'm Southeast Asian. My daughter's half Southeast Asian. Loves that noodle, and so did I growing up. But in the past, since I was probably in my late teens, I've discovered that it's not really healthy. And I still have yet to figure out why. I think I know why, and I'll explain. I came up with a hack for it. So, Gianna, will you open up the package and show us what it looks like inside? We can put it down. Yeah. No, um, yeah, we can. I think the noodles are self explanatory. Go ahead and get that out of it. Nope, take the oil out. Take the oil cool. So inside this packet, I mean, of course, they're all slightly different. Um, uh, the Western version was it um, Top Brand? Is that what it's called? Top Brand? I can't remember. They usually just comes with a one single packet. This particular one has a seasoning packet, a dry chili packet, and then garlic oil packet. They say they just put this stuff on in a bowl. You heat up some water and then you rehydrate this crunchy little thing. So, like I said, you know, 20 years ago, I was trying to figure out why does everybody say it's unhealthy? Um, and everything that you research, it talks about how this is such high in sodium, right? Uh, you look at these packets, they'll tell you that one serving uh, is up to like half of your sodium intake for the day, which is not very good. This little tiny packet. And so I always thought that was the case, but in actuality, I truly believe, and correct me if I'm wrong, it's the noodles that makes it unhealthy. Boy, I'm gonna try to find some links for you uh, after I post this video and share with you how they make noodles that they are instant. Long story short, it's like it's this huge plant. It runs through these conveyor belts, and in order to make the, the flour, they have to add so many preservatives to it. And just, just imagine mass producing anything, you, you often have to add preservatives or add things that you normally don't want to eat or consume. It's the nature of how business works in, in factories. So because of that, I allow Gianna to have these things, but I replicated the noodles. She so does not in love with it. Uh, so in here below is just some noodles um, that I that I suggest: plant-based noodles, noodles that are super high in protein um, and, or organic. Now this brand is quite good and you can use anything you want. I mean, there's, even at Walmart, they have probably six or seven different brands you choose from. These are the ones I like. And I'll have the links up here for you as well. What's really cool then, I'm slowly evolving and not letting her use these as well. So what I do is, instead of the oil packet, I use coconut oil and I just add fresh garlic to it. That's one hack. That you actually like some noodles. I didn't know that. Yes, I do that. Um, I mentioned this in my other video. I actually make my own beef towel. This has already been made. I use. I put this in her soup sometimes. This is new. The oily, and then and again, I would uh, saute garlic, and I put that in with her soup. I forgot to share about this last time we were we were on, on, but this is Celtic salt. Unfortunately, it came in a bag, and I didn't like the way the bag shaped, so I put it in this container. But this is Celtic salt. It has a lot of minerals, super healthy. Um, it looks a little different. I don't know if you can see that. Hopefully I'm holding it right. It's pretty cool. You've been eating this. Um, Barbara O'Neill claims that this actually helps uh, be less dehydration as well. So if you're dehydrated, you should have, just put a little bit of Celtic salt underneath your tongue and just wait until it dissolves. So it's really good for you. I, put it, I sneak it into your water sometimes. What's really cool is again, to replace the packet, 
I don't think these seasonings are that bad to you, for you to be honest. But again, I'm trying to get away from having to purchase this. So I've been adding or making uh, this umami seasoning. It's mushroom and garlic, all natural, organic. And then this is Kinder's. I just tried this. It's a salt blend. It's made of truffle sea salt, which is delicious. So again, lots of substitutions. So your child can have non-instant noodles, but instant, and it's good for you. Like to share anything? <laughs> Thanks, guys.